in tourism because uh, I like to explore the world and I like to share. I like to share with others, uh, you know, things that they can explore and get to know. And uh, you know, when you have the knowledge of a place like I think I know Thorsup pretty well, um, it's just easy to help people see what's worth seeing around here. Food is my passion, but I've, I've liked kayaking all of my life, and uh, <clears throat> I think it's a nice way to explore, to get out on the water a little bit, to be able to see, get a little bit closer to the birds and sometimes, you know, other animals that you might see out there, but it's, it's peaceful on a nice day when it's not windy, and uh, it also offers people something to do when they come here, so they're not just driving through town or stopping for a meal, they can actually explore a little bit. I think to go to the uh, cliffs out in Storikart, you know, go out to Longanas and uh, view the birds, but also just sometimes stand there, listen to nothing, and not see anybody. I think that's something that's special here. I think tourism has had an impact, uh, especially with the younger kids. Um, they're wanting to work more and more in tourism and uh, becoming a little bit more social. So I think it has had a positive impact. Well, I'm, I'm a teacher in school. I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> but uh, the kids are doing, um, we have Heimelis Friday, we have the cooking part here at the restaurant. And I think that's a bit special because um, we're not usually cooking just cakes. We're doing uh, a lot of different types of food. So. I mean, I think it, it has an impact this way. And also, you know, we let the kids, we take the kids kayaking from time to time. We are a small restaurant. We can seat maybe 50 people, and we do what we do well. So, um, I like to be able to do the 50 people well rather than have serve 80 or 100 people like this. So.